Illegal, dangerous, and happening more often. Last night, at least one person was cited by Metro Police for flying a drone illegally over downtown's fireworks display. News Channel 5's Chris Conti is live tonight. And Chris, there are strict guidelines for drone users, correct? And Vicki, all of those guidelines have been put in place by the FAA. Whenever you are flying a drone, you have to be able to see it. That includes us here at News Channel 5. It is illegal to fly a drone at night unless you have special permission from the FAA. There were no flight restrictions over downtown last night, but still those who are experienced in flying drones say it wasn't a safe environment. It all seems so perfect, so dazzling. Everything about last night was just so mesmerizing, which made two flashing lights in the night sky above downtown Nashville seems so out of place. See that right there? The alternating red and green? That is a drone. You shouldn't be flying through fireworks. I mean, it's just ridiculous. And this is Al Tompkins. Al teaches journalists from around the country how to properly pilot drones. Quite the opposite of whoever was in control of this unmanned aircraft last night. Flying through fireworks is a stupid idea. I mean, how much of a chance would you be willing to take to get an image like that? It is against FAA rules to fly a drone at night unless you have special permission. And anyone piloting a drone must also always maintain the aircraft in their line of sight. He's clearly at nighttime. He's clearly right in the middle of the fireworks. But there's another much more obvious problem that Al sees in this video. We don't know who's going to copy this. A clear disregard for the safety of the 200,000 people watching the fireworks downtown. And they ought to be criminally charged. It is endangerment. There's no excuse for it. Al's concern, it will be harder for licensed drone pilots to fly if others create problems. These are not toys. They're like flying blenders. You can cause great harm. They're also terrific tools. Unclear though, if next 4th of July, fireworks will be the only thing flashing over downtown. It's only just a matter of time before somebody else does it. From Metro Police late this afternoon, we've learned that the man who was cited for reckless endangerment for flying that drone over downtown is 20 year old Samuel Dobbs. How did they catch him? Well, he landed his drone right in the middle of the crowd downtown and someone else was arrested last month after flying a drone over the crowd during the Pred celebration. Simply put, just make sure you know what you're doing. We are live downtown this evening. Chris Conti, News Channel 5. Chris, thank you.